to bag lady so i hope you're all well first thing i need to say if you've been contacted by me or replied to a message on youtube saying you've won something you haven't won something sadly i've been like hacked um and somebody sort of messaged everybody on my youtube channel telling them they'd won um i really wish that i could give everybody on my youtube channel a prize but sadly i can't um i've managed to report it to youtube um and then I think I've blocked, managed to block them. So I think the comments have disappeared. But if you did sort of read it, then please just ignore it. We've not drawn the jelly bag giveaway yet. It's still live and running. So don't worry. I will personally let you know if you've won. And it will be on my actual video. Scammers are so naughty. I don't know what they get out of it, but it's horrible. So if you've had a message, please, please ignore it. Anyway, so it's not Monday. It's Tuesday going to be a cloudy day today but i think it's gonna be dry till later don't like cloudy days they're a bit bleh. i prefer it like a bit of sunshine or even if it actually rains but when it's just cloudy it's a bit boring <laughs> if that makes sense so i've just done my makeup so i've got on my avon true color foundation which gives you really good coverage but then i mix it up with some serum foundation because that gives you a nice glow don't forget you can get samples of all these you can even get samples of my favourite skincare. I've used the new, um, oh, I can't remember what it's called, the new creams that I showed you yesterday, last night again, and they just plump your wrinkles. Honestly, I cannot recommend it enough. It's so, so good. Anyway, so my Avon link is down below. Um, if you spend £23, you get free UK delivery straight to your door. Now, let's look at calendar of the day. So, are we ready? Dun, 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 dun. Each day comes bearing its own gifts. Untie the ribbons. That's very, very true. I love this calendar so much. I hope they're going to make one again for next year. Love it. Oh, that's so lovely. So today, don't let anything stop you. Go and do what you want to do. Anyway, so let's go get some breakfast. Right, there's my breakfast. Or oh, is it chasing you again? Yeah. <laughs> so for breakfast this morning, we've got the crazy Pomeranian. Can you hear this? She chases Ruby every time Ruby walks. <laughs> so, anyway, we've got jelly, um, but grapes, cereal bar, banana, and a cup of tea in my mug of the day. And see what I mean about the weather? It's a bit gloomy out there, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, right, let the boring jobs begin. So, we need to try and think how to be a bit more cheerful today because the weather's very gloomy. I actually want to get outside though because I want to pop my couple of little balls that um, I got the pots for yesterday. Oh, they so wet. So I've got my old sort of clothes on again. Um, so we'll see when we're done a boring job and stuff if we can get outside. Right, so as you all know, I want to go outside and carry potting around in my garden, but I just wanted to show you this. It's fluff and dog air all in my house. Everywhere I want cleaning and hoovering. Look, it's all dusty, but I just wanted to share it with you because if you need to clean or dust, you're not the only one and it makes you feel better to know that you're not alone and you can't do everything in life. So if you're outside gardening, you can't be inside cleaning. So we all have to make decisions sometimes and you have to do what's best for you. So if you've got a bit of fluff on your floor or a bit of dog hair, so bloody what? <laughs> it doesn't matter. Just ignore it from a distance. It looks fine. Anyway, so at some point today or tomorrow, we will be hoovering or vacuuming, whatever you want to call it. But for now, I'm going to see if I can go outside. And also, we'll also ignore my ironing pile, which I might get that done today. Ugh. It's horrible. <laughs> Is that normal? <laughs> you're not normal, that's why you live with me. <laughs> right, okay. So we'll just ignore the bit of randomness going off over there. <laughs> you're so loud. Right, so these are my two pots that I got. There's my compost and my plants. Oh. There, so there's one there and one there. I'm thinking I can perhaps do like a little 
display around here somewhere, I'm thinking, if it works out right. Don't they look at all your toys and why are they all out here? And why are they all wet? <laughs> Ooh. Right, first job. Poke some holes in it. So I've got my scissors and I've stabbed some holes in it. So I just need to do this one next. Right, so one there. I think I'm going to put one there and then it kind of looks like it's always been there which I think will be really nice and the sun came out the sun's come out and it's absolutely boiling I cannot believe it because I've got black on I can feel it burning my back through the black of my t-shirt it's so hot oh it's coming together so I think that's lovely because it looks like it's the pot sort of been there and the flowers have grown around it and then I'm thinking if I can get another pom-pom, not pom-pom, another like ball plant to go in that one, then I really love balls. That sounds terrible, doesn't it? <laughs> I really love balls and I think they look so good. So I'd need to get one for there as well, I think. And can you believe my husband hasn't noticed her? <laughs> How can you not notice a new lady in your garden? But he hasn't. Wow, I've come back in. So I've got my pots in. Look at me. I'm so hot and I'm covered in soil. It's up my arms. It's all over my legs. Ugh. I don't think it's on my clothes. It's just on my legs, I think. So I should be still right to wear these for the rest of the day. But I think I'm going to have to brush the rest of myself down. And I'm so hot. I cannot believe how hot it is. <sighs> when that sun comes out, the heat is unbelievable. Right, feet all washed. I've got to have like a little stand up. Hose down, so I've hosed myself down, so I'm all nice and clean again. But <laughs> I'm still really hot. I said to Ruby, I feel like I've got burnt. Where I was just in that corner filling the pot up, it's really hot in that corner, and it's got hotter and hotter and hotter. And I feel like the sun has actually like burnt me. It was so hot, but the sun's gone back in again now, and it's really cloudy. This weather is so strange. And there's a fly somewhere in my kitchen. I can't actually see it. I think it's in a window. Ooh, I hate flies. So we've come outside to test my little seating area. What do you think? It's nice, it's isn't it? We're just saying we think we want a little water feed to like another solar one. Oh. So that when you sat here, you can hear water running. Because it's very quiet. I think the water running would be really nice. Oh, right, so Ruby's gone out with her friends. So she's gone off to Laser Quest. So I've brushed myself up some dinner. So I've got three little cracker things, lettuce, tomato, and a little bit of ham, and a cup of coffee in my desperate housewife mug. Right, my dinner was lovely. I could do with a nice piece of cake, but we're not going to eat cake. So it's now 10 to 2. I can't believe how fast today has gone. It's flying by. So next job of the day, I'm going to do my ironing and ring my mum, and I wait for a little parcel to come as well, so I can't go out. Um, which would have been nice because I am actually on my own at the minute, but never mind. So we'll get the ironing done. Ah, I've been on the phone to my lovely mum. I've still not finished my ironing. <laughs> it's horrible. There's so much. I've finished. Everybody's asleep. Winnie's asleep. Dolly's asleep. Florence is asleep. It's like being in an old people's home with lots of like restful people. It's really nice. So the music's not on loud. But I'm going to put the kettle on because my hubby's on his way back. So I'm going to make me and my hubby a nice cup of coffee. Mm. I've still got to pair all this up though. wonder if we'll have any odd socks today. Ooh, ladies and gentlemen. I'm very excited. I've got to go and fetch my neighbour's paper from the shop. Um, and my hubby's come back in this beautiful BMW. And you know I love to try out different cars. Um, so I'm going to shop in it. I'm so excited. I've always wanted a car with cream leather. It's a BMW X4, I think. Um, but it's beautiful, it's so light in here, it's gorgeous. Right, let's go to the shop and get more posh. I'm back home. Oh, it's lovely. I really like that, it was very, very nice. I love the light coloured leather, it's really light. But it's really nice. It's fabulous. I enjoyed that. Very nice. Mm, got a good size boot as well. And I think it's got like electric. You press the button, it shuts itself. Ah, it's lovely.
and back down to earth with a bump. So, and I need to put all my ironing away. Oh. <laughs> so that's all my ironing put away. I'm just looking as a bee having a rest. And that's my little pot that I got yesterday as well that I did this morning. I love these like Morris ceramics, they're so pretty. I've literally just put a bit of ivy in it, but it just looks so nice. I can't believe how warm it is. And I've just spotted a massive weed. How did I not spot that yesterday? Look at that weed. It's massive. I need to pull that out. Right, so I've fed my hubby, I've fed Ruby. They've both gone off to my mum, so my hubby's dropping Ruby off, she's going to stay at my mum's for a couple of nights. So I'm all alone. James is not back from work yet. So I've got my old clothes on, my jeans are so tight. You don't realise, you've only been wearing shorts all the time and then you put your old jeans on, I can own just fasten them up. <laughs> so that's why there's no more cake. Anyway, so, because I'm on my own, I suddenly thought, I'm going to colour my hair. I've got real rootage going off and I thought, you know what, well, there's no one here, it's quarter past five, it's not the sort of thing you normally do at quarter past five, but I thought if it takes me an hour, then my tea's nearly done, I've only got to pop it in the oven for like five minutes, so I'm going to colour my hair quickly while there's no one here. Let's get it done! So I'm using this one, I have used this one before, I normally use the dark auburn one, but I decided to use this one for a change because this one's easier to get than the auburn one, so we're going for a bit of dark golden brown. Five minutes left, and can you believe it? Somebody's already knocked on my door. I didn't answer it. I'm not going to the door like this, don't scare anybody. <laughs> but um, I've got five more minutes, then I'll put it all through to the end, and then it'll be done. Right, it's 25 to 7. Finally finished my hair. Let me show you. Here I am. So I've chopped a bit more off it as well. The bottom of it's really nice, but my roots are a different colour. I don't know if you can see this. So I'm perhaps going to have to put something else over it because my roots are a very different colour to the ends of my hair, which is slightly worrying. Um, it'll do for now, but I think I'm definitely going to have to put something over that. Look. Can you see the difference? Oh dear, that's not good. Right, so we've covered the grey, but we've now got brown coloured roots. Looks okay from a distance. Right, there's my tea. So it's about quarter to seven, so I'm a bit late with my tea. I really don't like my coloured roots. They look very odd, but I'm sure, I think they probably look worse on camera than they do in real life. So I've took a mirror outside and they're not too bad, but I do need to put something on it, I think. Anyway, so, there's my tea, so I've got my Weight Watchers wrap with cooked chicken inside, boiled eggs and lots of salad, off to enjoy it. Ever get the feeling you're being watched? <laughs> They're all waiting for me to get up and feed them. <laughs> so, I was just looking at my hair, I can't believe when I come inside how much darker it looks. It's quite shiny. Anyway, faffing on to. So my dears, I'm going to love you and leave you. So many, many thanks for joining me again today. I hope you've enjoyed it. So if you do enjoy just a little bit of real life, then please subscribe to my channel. Come and find me on Instagram as Mrs. Crazy Bag Lady. My dogs, wherever they are, have got their own Instagram, which is three fluffles. My website is down below. My little Avon shop is also down below. So I'll love you and leave you. I will see you tomorrow. Take care, everyone. Bye.